On a chilly evening last Wednesday night, a tough field of form greyhounds made the trip to Bulleye for the final of the Group 3 Bulleye Gold Cup. While now a puppy classic winner Stilton Blue and star Victorian dog walk hard went into the race's favourites, it was an outsider who caused an upset when my boy Snoop trained by Anthony as a party took out the race in a time of 26-11. Racing, Stilton Blue came out running, he's charging, so is Unleashed a Fear. My Boy Snoop holding third, then Walk Hard, highly respected Gradens. They were followed up by My Awesome Opal. Knockers return at the tail, we've got a real good race. Stilton Blue by two to Unleashed a Fear. My Boy Snoop the danger to the leader. Stilton Blue in the lead, My Boy Snoop coming. Stilton Blue grabbed by My Boy Snoop. My Boy Snoop won the cup, beat Stilton Blue. Uh, Anthony, congratulations. Fantastic run. Uh, did you think though that it had uh, gone out of your grasp? Look, when he come out like that tonight, and I see him shuffling up a little bit up the, up the back straight, and I couldn't see what exactly what was happening in the corner, but when I seen him turn it for home, I knew he was close enough to do it, you know? And uh, what were your emotions when he was coming down that uh, down the straight? It must have been a wonderful moment. It was, mate, because Terry drove all the way for today to come all the way to Bulleye, and for me, him to come tonight to see his dog race, you know, it's a fantastic feeling for him, you know. Whatever we do at home with all his dogs, it's all for him because he's such a great owner, he's such a great bloke, he's my best mate, you know, we've known each other for a long time now and it's great to have success with him, you know. Uh, you're no stranger to victories, but uh, what is this feeling like, you know, when you get a win in a, in a race of this size? Oh, it's a great feeling. Every group race is icing on the cake, you know, and um, tonight was a great feeling. Mate, it's undescribable, honestly. It's something you can't really describe. It's that much joy inside you, but you sort of don't hit you straight away, but tonight it sort of hit me a little bit, you know? So, no, look, very exciting. It's overwhelming, it is. And uh, a word on the dog now. Uh, what do you sort of see? What's he got uh, planned for him now? Um, well, I'll go to Victoria this uh, Sorry, on Sunday I'll leave to go to Victoria with him. I'll bypass the Peter Mossman. There's a few races at Sandown I want to put him in. A um, couple of fifth grades there, so that's the aim. So end of the year, the Melbourne Cup and all that, you know, that's all the plans. So we'll get him used to the meadows and sand down. When it's time to go down there, at least he's had a few races and a few trials, you know. Do you think he can be a contender at those big races? Most definitely. This dog's got a real big engine. He's, he's a very fast animal. He's probably only hiccup his box manners. But in time, you know, he might get better and better, you know. Like tonight, he come out probably the best he's ever come out for a long time. Because um, he's a big dog too. So I really think he'll be on a podium sometime in the future anyway again. Bit of luck anyway. <laughs> Good on you. Thank you. Thanks.